this the breakdown. You had the roller rinks, and all of the roller rinks that I went to had a big skating rink where everybody skated. Then they had the smaller rinks. Those smaller rinks were turning into breaking and popping sessions. And then there was the rug area, and this is the breakdown. If you were really good, you could dance on the wooded in the wooded area. If you weren't that good, you got shuffled over to the rug section until you got better to be able to even jump in those ciphers. And to me, that's cipher etiquette. You had to know whether you can jump in or not. And if you didn't know, they let you know. And they taught you what you should and should not be doing. So that's an environment I grew up in, grew up in when it came to the roller rinks. And then hearing stories about clubs like the Fun House, um, the Roxy's, Roseland, Bonds International, the Garage. You know, when you're young, it's almost like hearing about these legendary places where these legendary dancers go to. So you're practicing because that's your goal. And that was my goal.